guys, Hacksaw Tech here for another video tutorial for you guys. So today I'm going to be taking a look at a new application I found called Waze. It's a social navigation application that's available for the iPad and for iPhone. So basically what this application does, it gives you turn-by-turn -turn navigation directions um, on your iDevices for free. It's called Waze, W-A-Z-E. So really, really great, really awesome application. Uh, if you take a look here, uh, this is the main interface of the application. So you can actually use your finger and you can move around. And you can kind of just go around wherever, uh, wherever you'd like to. Take a look at the different streets, buildings, and everything. So you can kind of just scroll around if you want to see what's near you, which is really neat. And then at any point, if you see the little circle with the lines at the bottom left-hand corner, if you click that, takes you right back to your home location so wherever you're currently at uh, assuming that you're in a car or wherever it might be it'll take you right back to that location uh, so that's pretty neat and you can kinda just use that to navigate around you also notice as you look through the application uh, if there are any other people any other members using the application nearby you actually see them on the map interface so uh, on the bottom left hand corner you also notice another little icon a white icon if you click that, it brings up your main Waze application uh, navigation features. So you'll see uh, several different icons that you can click on here. The first one we're going to take a look at is Navigate. So if you go to Navigate here, you'll notice that they've got a search pane that pops up. You can actually search by address, place, or contact. So the first thing that I noticed with this application is it's really, really nice that you don't have to know the address of wherever you're trying to go in order to find and navigate to that place. For instance, on many of the paid applications available on the App Store and many of the actual paid GPS's that you'll purchase at stores like Staples, Best Buy, you actually have to know the address of wherever you're trying to go to, which is alright, but it makes it a little bit more difficult if you're trying to pl find a place you're not familiar with. So I really like that you can actually search for uh, locations by name. So we'll go ahead and show you how that works here. Let's say I wanted to search for Staples. I could go ahead and search for Staples, click search. It's going to bring up a list of all the Staples locations nearby. So if I just click on one of those locations, it'll go ahead and bring up a preview of uh, that Staples. You can see a map location with the pinpoint on there of where it's at. You can see the address of that Staples. You can see the phone number for that store. You can also click to get more info. Uh, there's a go button, so you can click that, which will navigate you there, or you can even add it to your favorites. We'll just go ahead and click go so that we can uh, see the navigation. And now it's going to go ahead and give you all the information that you need. So it gives you the ETA, uh, when you're expected to arrive there, and also about how long it's going to take to get to that location. In addition to that, it also gives you about how many miles, uh, just approximately, it is away from you. So if you look in the application here, obviously I'm not going to be driving anywhere. I'll go ahead and show you here. It gives you a nice uh, direct route. You can kind of just follow that here. And as you're driving, it does have voice navigation, turn-by-turn -turn voice navigation. So you can follow the path. And it'll take you right to your location, just like you'd expect from a paid GPS application. So for a free price tag, this is a really, really, really awesome app. Uh, so far, everywhere I've gone, every location I've put in here, completely completely accurate uh, the really cool thing about this app is that it's all social uh, social based so any information on here is from you guys anytime you have your cell phone running this application and you're on the road the data from your phone uh, and based off the location that you're at is what's actually generating the information on the application so they're not actually giving all the information to the app it's the data from the users that actually helps this application run and that's why it's actually free so that's really really cool uh, if you n take another look here at this bottom application button here there's a couple new things you'll note here it's got my ways and if you click on that it'll take you into this little interface here they've actually got something called the scoreboard which is kind of a neat little thing that they did here if you click on my points you'll notice that they've got different levels that you can actually achieve. So you start off as a Waze baby, 
And as you progress, you get different ratings like Ways Warrior, uh, Knight, whatever it might be. And these little statuses will actually get you special features. For instance, as you progress, you will be able to look at gas prices from local gas stations and get the best price and then get the navigation to that gas station, which is kind of a neat little thing that can save you some money. Um, if you take a look back here at the main page, a couple new things you'll notice as well. If I go to this bottom right hand corner, there's going to be another little white application. If I click on that, they've got what are called reports. So you can actually report information as well from this application. Again, this is all social oriented, so you can actually interact with other people very intuitively. I can report traffic information, so I can report uh, traffic accidents. If I see a speed trap nearby, I can report speed traps. I can report uh, weather hazard, so if it's maybe raining, pouring down rain in a certain location, uh, you can advise people nearby that it's raining really hard, maybe they want to take a different route to get to work. Um, you can talk to people with chit chat, and talk to people that are using the application, uh, you can check in so they know that you're uh, using the application, you can see gas prices, so they've got a couple, uh, several really nice features built into the application that I've really never seen in any other application before for turn-by-turn -turn navigation. Um, other than that, you know, those are the main features of the application. I definitely encourage you guys to check it out. It is a free download. It's called WAZE.com. You can find it on the website or you can go to the App Store and search for it there as well. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this little tip tutorial. Um, be sure to look for some new tutorials as well coming out in the future. Rate, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.